Hey y'all, what is up? Welcome or welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Wildflower Tea. And today, my friends, we are gonna be doing a full breakdown of all the information that has came out as of late involving Mama June's oldest daughter, Anna Chickadee Cardwell, and her latest diagnosis of stage four adrenal carcinoma cancer. Back in January, Anna was having some pretty severe stomach aches. So of course she went to the doctor just to get a checkup and make sure everything was okay. At that point, they did a series of tests and found out that Anna not only had stage four adrenal carcinoma cancer, but that it had also moved to her kidneys, lung, and her liver. This is something that both Anna and her family decided to keep under wraps for a little bit as Anna prepared for her first round of chemo and fighting this cancer. It wasn't until last week that we as the public found out a lot of this information. And since then, the Mama June crew has been very vocal on social media, not only showing their love and support to Anna, but also just speaking out in more detail about how this has affected their family. It's mainly bigger on my kidney area than it is on my everything else. I've only had one round of chemo so far, and I got like two or three more to go they want to do before I do any more. It is stage four, y'all. They removed this first one, um, and that's when this one came back. Stage four, me, that's the last stage of cancer. Uh, my next chemo is the night i think well i wish they would remove my kidney y'all but they won't do that y'all i am gonna go bald regardless because like look y'all i have a whole ass hairball of hair that will show it so this is all my hair that i've lost i'm not even gonna lie to y'all this is all the hair that i've lost all of it all of my hair that i've lost y'all i don't need a kidney i don't need a kidney <laughs> i don't need a kidney yeah chemo makes me sick the last two days of my chemo do make me sick but the first two days are I'm okay with the first two days but the last two days I'm it dra it's really draining and very I get very nauseous yes y'all I'm gonna wear a wig as you can see Anna is trying to remain in high spirits throughout all of this but the cancer has definitely taken a toll on her body after just one round of chemo she has already lost a substantial amount of hair and as she stated does plan on wearing wigs in the future and has already started adding those to her Amazon wish list she also goes into a bit more detail on how the chemo makes her body feel after the first couple of days very exhausted and just nauseous which I am sure is not easy to deal with especially as a mother with children to take care of this was the reminder I needed as a mother and maybe you guys as well of how important it is to take care of yourself and make sure you're okay Anna is only 28 years old and outside of some stomach aches she had no symptoms prior to going to the doctor since this news broke last week, other members of the Mama June crew have been speaking out as well. Alana Thompson, aka Honey Boo Boo, took to her Instagram story last week to share this message with the world. This is what I mean when I say you never truly know what somebody is going through at home, no matter how famous they are. Yes, I'm very famous, but normal-ish happens to me and my family, and y'all need to realize that ASAP. When it comes to Mama June and Anna's relationship, as I'm sure a lot of you know, they have had an extremely rocky past. But sources say that Mama June knew immediately that she needed to be there for Anna once she found out about her diagnosis. They also stated that Mama June feels that the past is simply in the past, and she's now doing whatever she can to help Anna, including watching the kids' for her whenever Anna isn't feeling well. And according to TMZ, Mama June has been going to Anna's appointments with her and just wanting her daughter to know that she is there for her as a support system. And I will say I have noticed that a lot of fans of the show have had questions about Mama June and Anna's relationship due to the claims that have came out in the past. All I'm going to say about this is when something like this happens within your family, I know from personal experience, it really does put into perspective just how short life is. When you weigh what is more important, Anna's life and being there for her in this time where she needs it most is most definitely way more important than any of the rest of it. I'm positive that their relationship isn't 110%, but instead of dwelling on any of that, they as a whole are trying to just make sure Anna knows that they are there for her as a support system and that she is loved. And at the end of the day, in my personal opinion, that's all that really matters in this situation. But I would love to hear your thoughts and opinions 
questions on all of this, you guys. This is devastating news, and my thoughts and prayers are definitely going out to Anna and the whole family. Y'all, please leave some well wishes in the comments down below. Also, if you haven't already, please consider liking this video, subscribing, and tapping the bell. That way you're notified of all of my future content. Thank you guys so much for tuning in. I appreciate you all to the moon and stars and into my next one. Bye y'all.